Hey, Picks and Parlay family. It's me, Detroit Lenny, here with a free and uh, college football pick for you for Thursday, November 9th. We're going to talk Virginia and Louisville. And to do that, we're going to bring in our guy, Nick Parsons, here. How we doing, Nick? How's uh, everything treating you over at college football arena, I guess? Yep, fantastic. Enjoying another uh, solid season. And so looking forward to uh, closing out strong. And, I mean, bowl season's just right around the corner, if you can Right around it. the corner, Yeah. I feel like college football just started, but uh, it is, it is. Virginia Cavaliers traveling to Louisville, taking on the Cardinals. Cardinals minus 20, over under sits at 50 and a half. This is a lot of points for this Louisville, right? 13th ranked in the country, Louisville. I want to put some respect on mm -hmm. their name. Take it away, Nick. Yeah, well, as you know, Lenny, typically I don't side with the public. I'm a contrarian at heart, but of course, you know, that's not always the case. I mean, the public does indeed nearly win 50% of the time, really. And so, yeah, I'm not expecting any upset here. I, I think 8-1 Louisville, it's going to keep the foot on the gas from start to finish in this favorable matchup versus 2-7 and seven Virginia. Now, Virginia, it did somehow manage to upset a ranked UNC team on the road, and then it forced overtime versus Miami the following week. Uh, but the Cavaliers, they definitely came crashing back to reality in a 45 to 17 home loss to Georgia Tech, they allowed 515 total yards of offense. Uh, the Cavaliers, uh, the, you know, they're a great defensive team on the college basketball court, but they're terrible on the gridiron. They're allowing 32.4 points per game this year. That's last in the conference. Uh, Virginia also only managed 351 yards of offense against Georgia Tech, against a defense that is allowing 455.2 yards per game. Uh, overall, the Cavaliers only averaged 23.1 points per game this season. Now, the Cardinals, they do have that disappointing loss to Pitt, but last week they blew out Virginia Tech 34-3. to That gave them uh, three consecutive victories by at least 20 points. I think they're going to win in similar fashion in what, to what we saw last weekend, Lenny. Uh, the Cardinals, they limit their opponents to just 88.8 .8 yards per game on the ground. Overall, they're allowing just 16.3 yards per game and the offense is averaging 32.9 yards per game. And so, as I said off the top, I think Louisville is going to keep the foot on the gas from start to finish in this one in this favorable ma favorable matchup, Lenny. So lay the points. I, I, listen, I just think Louisville is going to roll. Just like I think that you hit the nail on the head when you said just like last week, and they won last week like 34 to three. I think it's a very similar game here. I don't know if the Cavaliers can get. I don't think they score 10 points. Let's put it that way. Um, don't forget, if you're looking for more from Nick Parsons on a premium side, check out his premium plays at picksandparlays.net. Use the promo code NCAAF. That'll save you 20% off your entire purchase over there. Till then, though, Nick says take the Cardinals on Thursday when they take on Virginia and Cavaliers. Lay the points. We'll be good. I'm Detroit Lenny Picks and Parlays. Nick Parsons, we appreciate you. Good luck, unless you're against us. Take care, folks.